Oh, it's Andrew again. Um, I have the Neo TV Max configured. Um, it's turned on and CEC is enabled on the device. As we can see over here, player one is not available as an option to select the um, Neo TV. And then also when I switch to this menu, you can see that the player is not listed there, but it also um, doesn't provide the option to set the um, speaker output to my home theater, to home theater, which is the AVR. So this, this whole um, aspect of CEC is um, not working properly. So I'm going to go ahead and turn off CEC support on the device. And then I'm going to power cycle everything. And I'll come back and show you what that looks like. Oh, this is Andrew again. We're back with the uh, Neo TV Max. Um, here we can see on the screen that the uh, CEC support is turned off. And um, I'm going to go and select the Viera Link menu again. And we can see now that Viera Link is essentially not working. Um, the player is not listed, which it shouldn't be because the CEC is off. But also the speaker output is no longer selectable, so I can't change between the TV or the AVR for the for output. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to physically unplug the Neo TV Max and then plug in the older Neo TV, the NTV 200, and then we'll go ahead and um, see that CEC support is off. And I'll probably have, yeah, I'll have to power cycle the TV and the AVR. I'll turn it back on again. And what we'll see here in a second, as soon as everything comes back up again, is that the Viera link is now working properly, where um, I can select between the... Uh, speakers in my TV and my AVR. So something is clearly not right with the uh, HDMI CEC implementation on the Neo TV Max. Um, thanks for watching.